It's raining, it's pouring, for H2O is boring, evaporation, condensation, precipitation, collection, even night and morning. At that moment, I just dropped, because I just couldn't believe it. I mean, I'm like, why? Why did it have to be my daughter? Take a big breath. Daviana has leukemia. See your belly? That's your belly. We see her about once a month for her chemotherapy, her treatment. How are you? Good. She just has a wonderful, wonderful spirit, even when she's hospitalized for weeks at a time. In the kitchen, and we have snacks, and we watch TV, as you know, and we have a refrigerator with drinks and coffee. And her mom, Laquita, she's a single mom. Daviana is her only child. And I know that Laquita has really struggled, especially when Daviana has these extended hospitalizations to maintain her work schedule. Just bills after bills after bills, then have to take care of her. And it's just been hard. And I'm on a fixed income. I mean, I don't make anything at work. I just have to put it in God's hand. The Foundation for Children with Cancer is one of the primary resources that I use for families who are um, having financial struggles. Just because your child is sick, you know bills are still coming. The foundation has been a lifesaver for her whenever she's needed a little extra help. Well, my rent was due and I was like out of pocket with money. They ended up paying my rent and it was a blessing. Our mission is to help families with their living expenses. We do not um, give a check directly to the family. We pay directly to the vendor, as in the mortgage company, the car company, the utility company. That way we ensure that the bills are getting paid. That's so very helpful for our families. Thought I was gonna end up getting put out, but they was there to save me. Even, you know, one month's rent, that's very, very important to families. The family can come to our organization, Foundation for Children with Cancer, for assistance once a year, and they can come back to us every year as long as the child is in treatment and then one year after treatment. See you later, beautiful. <laughs> See you later. It lifts so much weight off the shoulders. Okay, are we ready? That sounds like an understatement, but it, it means the world. It's one less thing that, that um, comes crashing down upon you. Can I count? Can I feel first? Yes. Okay, let me feel first. And then I'll let you count. Ready? Uh-huh. One, two, three, go. Here we go. Brian has a brain tumor. He's been treated for that since he was around three years old. Um, it's been a very long road for Brian and his family. He's been sick for almost nine years, eight and a half years, September 20th, 2001. It was the morning that our world changed forever. You think of cancer, you think of adults, you don't think of children. You don't think that that's going to happen to your son or your daughter. Their family, you know, they, they have needed assistance more than once. You're, you're just stuck. It's, you're stuck in, in a, a situation that um, there's no end to. My husband lost his job more than once. Um, mostly due to the hospitalizations. You want to spend every waking moment with your child. Big breath. If they were a two-income family and suddenly they're a one-income family, they still have the same bills, but now they only have one income coming in, one paycheck. You know, you get to a point where there's, you don't know where to turn. And that's where the foundation is really helpful, coming in and paying that entire amount so it sets the family on a clean slate with those bills. Without the foundation for children with cancer, we probably would have lost our house. I mean, these families need a lot of help. If you're looking at 12,600 new diagnoses every single year, and we are only helping around 400 plus families a year, we're not helping near enough families. We're not even touching the tip of the iceberg. They're helping with a very practical need that families have. Any donation that you make to the foundation is gonna go right back to a family. It means a whole lot. It's raining, it's pouring, for H2O is boring. I don't even know how to, I mean, to express it as much, but it, I mean, it mean I, I, I really appreciated it very much. And if I could see whoever who did it, to thank them, I mean, I will. I mean, it was a real big help. Thank you for everything. We want to be able to do more, and we really don't want to turn 
any family away. While research is absolutely very important, it's number one, financial assistance has to be talked about. Statistics are telling us 50% of families that have the child with cancer have had to file for bankruptcy. We have to talk about what these families are going through. We need advocates like you to, to help families like us because we're concentrating on our kids and we depend on organizations like the Foundation for Children with Cancer to help us. It's very helpful and it's helpful to families that's in need. Please support the Foundation.